Hello you guys and welcome. Today we are going to be doing something really fun. This is something brand new for me and I really have not heard anyone talk about this. I am talking about Annie's Kit Clubs. So this video is not sponsored. I bought this kit with my own money. My friend actually told me about it. She watches a lot of YouTube videos and she watches my DIYs and she actually, I don't even know how she found this, but she messaged me a while back and she told me about it. And she thought that it would be something I would be interested in and so I needed to check it out. So if you guys know about makeup subscription boxes, this is a DIY subscription box that you get every month. It's $20. Your first one is, I want to say it was 50% off. So I got it for $9.99, but then it was like $5, five or $6 for shipping. So the first one is like 16. And then I think anything after that is going to be around like 26. But let me just tell you about this one. So the one I got specifically is the farmhouse because I like the farmhouse style. You guys know that if you've been watching my videos. So they have a ton of different kits. I'm just, I'm on their website right now. I'm just gonna kind of go through. So, okay, select a club or craft club. Okay, I can't, I'm not even gonna list off all of them because there are so many. Uh, card maker, crochet, Christmas ornaments, creative girls, creative women. Um, the farmhouse, like I got holiday quilters, holly jolly quilt, hook and needle. Um, there's just tons. Oh, there's a beads one. I'm going to click on another one here because I've only really looked at the farmhouse ones. Uh, oh, that's cool. You get stuff for beads, like jewelry. That would be really cool. That might be something I'd be interested in too. Oh boy, this I have a feeling this is gonna be dangerous. Um, Annie's, if you wanna sponsor me or send me some free kits, I'm, I would love that. Anyways, so I just got my kit in the mail today and I wanted to unbox it with you guys. I Like I said, this is brand new. I kind of had an idea of what the first kit was gonna be just because they showed a picture of it when I was ordering it. And it's. I thought it would be really, really cute. So I'm assuming when the holidays come, maybe they'll send ones that are like holiday themed, like maybe Christmas or Thanksgiving. I'm not sure. This one that I'm going to open today is for October, I'm assuming. I don't know. I don't know if it's like BoxyCharm, how they're like, they have themes every month or whatnot. But I was super excited to get into this. And here's my thing. I love doing DIYs, but I have a hard time finding inspiration and thinking of what I should do. This does it all for you. It throws everything in a bag. It gives you every item you need for the for the craft, for the DIY, and you don't even have to think about it. And it gives you instructions. So like like I said, I haven't opened it yet, but my friend was telling me that they send you paints, paint brushes. She even got a thing of E6000 one time, and that stuff can get expensive. So I want to say $20 is a darn good deal for these. Yeah, I'm excited to get into it. So let's get into unboxing this and make this DIY. All right, so I figured I would just do a voiceover here because my family was going nuts in the background. So this is the cute little packaging that it comes in. And I will say it came pretty fast. I want to say within uh, maybe like a week. Yeah, it came pretty fast. So when you open it up, it's got everything right here. This is a picture of what we're going to be making. This is going to be a tiered tray. And then inside the bag has everything you're going to need for the project. You don't need to use any of your own stuff. I thought this was so cool. Uh, these are the paints. Uh, the white had a little issue. It definitely opened. Um, yeah, you'll see that in a little bit too. <laughs> and then like that has the little picture and the directions in there as well. And then this is a little thing of, I think it's like, it's a kind of E6000. It's not the kind I get at Hobby Lobby, but I'm sure it'll work just as well. This is a little topper piece. You get a nice paintbrush that the white paint got all over. <laughs> I don't know what happened with that. And then it came with these two little trays. And these are nice quality, you guys. These are like heavy duty, nice, decent quality. And then in here, it just kind of shows you the, oh, and the little wood dowel. And then in the little, it just tells you the directions. So step by step, easy peasy. If you guys are not good at crafting, this is foolproof. So now I'm getting into opening the paints. There's a black one and a white one. The black one um, is fine. It didn't open or anything. So I will be able to use that one. But the white one, I don't know what happened with that thing off here. <laughs> Hopefully I don't need a lot of what oh dear. Okay. Well, 
Oh, okay. Oh. Ah! Oh my gosh. Well, I'll be right back, but it's okay. Um, let's open this one. Okay, that one opened. <laughs> well, I definitely am not going to be saving these, so I'm just going to dump everything onto here. Okay, so it looks like you do the white over the black. So, just barely dip paintbrush end into paint, dab paint off on paper plate to remove majority of paint. This technique is also called, or is called dry brushing. You want very little paint on your paintbrush to give your piece a streaked paint look rather than fully coated. So we'll just do the little, this part. So yeah, I feel like I've definitely done a method like this before. So we're just gonna kind of do it really light and a little bit goes a long way. Okay, and then now we're gonna paint this black as well. Assuming, yeah, I just use the same brush. It's a nice brush. I have a Dollar Tree one, but this one's definitely better than that one. So yeah, basically it's just saying to paint, um, like paint both surfaces, just paint all of the pans, like bottom and top, and then let dry, repeat. Oh, and then it's saying to repeat steps one through seven with the white paint, if desired. So if I wanted to, I could just leave it black. Hmm. You know what, I might actually do that. I'm gonna let this dry and then I will be back and we will make our final decision. I also am gonna paint this little guy black as well. I forgot about him. All right guys, what did you think? I think this is such a cool idea. I am so excited that my friend told me about this. I'm excited to do this every month and I plan on doing an unboxing and a DIY with you guys every month. If you guys wanna order one, we could do them together. Um, if you guys wanna check it out, the website will be linked in the description box. Like I said, this video is not sponsored. I'm not getting anything for this. I think they have a coupon code for your 50% 50, 50 off your first kit. I'll put any info that I can find, I will throw that in the description box for you guys to check out. Let me know if you've ever heard of this subscription box, if you've tried it, let me know what you thought of this DIY. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you all soon. Bye.